because the third annual Fast Forward Film Festival is coming this weekend. And I, I would love to be the person who answers the phone <laughs> for all of that. That's me. Rebecca Delaney <laughs> is the festival director, probably has that chore. Yeah. Nick Ayanako, I said it right, yep. uh, is a student and a filmmaker of When It Rains and Birds of a Feather, Yes Too. And Brian Larson, a filmmaker of Love Song of the Drone and a professor at RIT. And from what I understand, professor student. Yes. That's right. So this yeah. is cool. And now direct competitors. Mm -hmm. Ooh, oh, <laughs> oh, we were saying this is first time in terms of first times being in the festival, but not first time filmmakers. Right. Yeah. Yeah. I've been okay. making films for several years. Nick's just getting started with it, but this is the first time for a fast forward. Yeah. Uh, being filmmakers in a in a community like Rochester and to have a festival right here for you guys is to be incredible. Yeah, it's great. I think so. Yeah, it's a great opportunity, and I'm, I'm glad to be a part of it this year. Okay, so we, we're looking at two here. Yep. Mm -hmm. It's happening Friday and Saturday. Yep, Friday at the Little Theater uh -huh. at 7 p.m., uh -huh. um, which is just a screening. We just show the movies. Um, that's a pretty low price point ticket. We hope that everybody can come to that. Uh, we do have a gala event. It's a green carpet gala, kind Ooh. of the, the one everybody talks about each year. It's our third year, um, and it's an environmental film festival. So mm -hmm. all these films are made by locals, five minutes or less, tell the story of their perspective with the environment, mm -hmm. um, really to hope to raise environmental awareness and to compel the audience to do something. Um, I think the coolest part about it is that the, there is two opportunities to see the movies, but we actually have multiple opportunities to see them after the festival as well so we don't just show them once and one like big hurrah weekend mm -hmm. we actually put them online afterwards as well okay so there are other opportunities but this event is really to bring the the community together to support the local filmmakers but also to talk about the environment and filmmaking and this is home of filmmaking mm -hmm. you know Kodak mm -hmm. and it's so neat to have RIT. These these two folks with me today are all RIT supportive um, and RIT related. So I think it's really neat to see RIT getting so involved this year. Um, and they're actually considering, you know, making it part of. Yeah, next year. Well, we have several classes where the students make films, and next year we're gonna we're talking about making it a specific, not a requirement, but uh, really. Uh, enforce it as an obligation perhaps mm. to make an, mm -hmm. an environmental film festival. A strong suggestion, if you right. will. Was that yours that we saw just a minute ago? Uh, I'm not sure which one you saw. Mine is the film Love Song of, Love Song of the Drone, which is about bees. There's a part of it up there now. Uh -huh. yeah. and, and a lot of it was animated. It's all animated. All mm -hmm. animated, okay. Yeah. Uh, Nick, is this, we're seeing some of yours now? Um, I haven't seen it yet. Okay. <laughs> this is short snippets of every film that oh, made it. Oh, gotcha. Mm -hmm. So gotcha. we did have so we did have uh, 17 selected juried films mm -hmm. that our jury selected. It's an acclaimed jury, um, and then the 17 films will be screened on Friday and Saturday. Fridays at the Little Theater and Saturdays at the George Eastman Museum. So it's kind of neat to have 17 make it in. We've only ever had about 15, 16 mm. films, but our jury couldn't decide. <laughs> oh, there that's was a good so thing. many great films this year that they put 17 in. Nicole. So. What year's, what's yours about? Um, I have two, and one of them is about a pigeon, and the other one is about a raindrop. So. Okay, give us a little more. A okay. pigeon. <laughs> uh, a pigeon looking for food in the city. Um, okay. And then the raindrop is um, looking for a flower that is not getting any rain. He's blocked by a mailbox, so it's his goal to, to reach that flower and water it. Wow. Mm -hmm. So his is animated. How did you make yours come to uh, Both of mine are also animated, 2D really? animation. Yep. Okay. Well, how long does it take to create something like that? Well, his was done as part of a class, mm -hmm. so he did his films in 15 weeks, which is remarkable. Uh, mine, I work sort of nights and weekends, so it took a little bit longer. Uh-huh. Yeah. Years. Yeah, <laughs> I bet. With that little job thing on the side. Right, get it in the way. Uh, exactly. Well, we look forward to seeing yours and, and maybe more from the program in the coming years. Congratulations yeah. to you both. Thank and you so much. Look, you're competitors, but still friends. <laughs> I love it. <laughs> uh, people can go to the website for more information. Yes, fastforwardrock.org. Uh, there are limited tickets still available. Uh, the gala always sells out, so okay. it would be nice if uh, folks could get on soon and okay. get their tickets before they sell out. Best Ford Film Festival. I just wanted to say it one more time yeah. before the second was up. <laughs>